So I'm very grateful that I get to spend my days doing something that I care a lot about and that's very personal to me. Um, in 2003, I started undergoing a lot of digestive issues and was on a series of a few years in and out of doctor's offices trying to figure out what was going on and why I was feeling the way I was and reacting to certain foods. It went on for about six years and no one could figure out what it was. Um, very upsetting and frustrating and finally liberation was reached in 2009 when I was uh, diagnosed with celiac disease. So that is an autoimmune disorder in which uh, someone can't process um, or digest gluten, which is a protein in wheat, barley, and rye. Um, it's a subject that hits home because it affects me and I'm gluten-free every single day of my life. And I'm very fortunate enough to be able to be in an environment that caters to individuals that have celiac disease or a gluten intolerance or just feel better overall eating gluten-free. So we had a customer come in um, a few months ago and she was a woman in her, I'd say mid 40s or 50s. She had just uh, undergone a huge diet change in her life. Um, for medical reasons and also personal reasons. And she was very limited as to what she could eat. Um, so she came in here kind of rattling off a few different things that she could and couldn't have. And I started to get nervous thinking, oh my gosh, we try to cater to so many different people. What can we possibly give this woman? And it ended up being our vegan healthy cookie. Um, it's a cookie made with certified gluten-free rolled oats, almond flour, uh, it's naturally sweetened with fruit, so we use the banana puree and some dried cherries and some chocolate chips. There's no added sugar. Um, it's a really healthy little indulgence, and uh, it was one of the few things that the woman could have on her crazy kind of diet. So we were elated that we were able to outfit her with something, and she was thrilled that she could eat something yummy.